Okay, I'm at 624 Johnson Glen. See? I think that's the right name, but whatever. I'll fix it on the video. So what you have is a zero lot line house. Pardon me? Okay. So I'm looking at the wrong place. <laughs> this is Diana the realtor. Okay, so you've got effectively a zero lot line home. Um, it's been pretty well rehabbed inside and a really good plus is that the uh, uh, HOA takes care of the roof and the paint and so forth in the front yard. So uh, that's very desirable. When you have the uh, composition shingles, uh, they can be a problem, but it shouldn't matter in this case. Pool looks clean, well cared for. I drove around in the uh, neighborhood and everything's in pretty decent condition. Don't see any uh, any obvious problems. The uh, floor is an upper grade laminate and appears to have been installed correctly. Not that common. I saw no evidence of any sort of uh, moisture damage, but I wouldn't expect any if the HOA is taking care of things. I don't have any, uh, I don't smell anything in particular. Now, anytime you put laminate in the kitchen, you're going to have problems. That's just a matter of when, not if. But uh, we're looking at, if you want to, I wouldn't do anything about it now, but it's going to be about $500 to do this should that be needed. It does need a new sink, but it's, and uh, this counter, it looks good. But what they've done is this is plain old laminate, and they've used some sort of an epoxy paint on it. But it looks very good. Wouldn't change anything. You would probably end up needing a new stove or at least replacing the top. And that's interesting. It's an electric stove. You don't see that too much. The backyard is very nice and well cared for. This is their storage. The eaves have been painted. I really am not seeing any issues at all. Now, they have the solar screen like on this window over here and this one. So the house is artificially dark, but it's not a dark house by uh, the construction. The uh, there are some blue accents and so forth, which traditionally has not rented well, but I think what we could do is, uh, well, I don't think we'll have to do a complete repaint. If we do, it's not that big of a house. Carpeting appears to be in good condition. Yeah, probably end up painting the whole house and get some standard colors. The uh, closets don't have doors. And when I looked at it, I don't think they ever have had doors. We could certainly put them in, but I'm not sure I would. That would cost about $200 for each one to put a door in. This is absolutely not what was in here originally. They've done a good bit of work. This is a, a very good property. Probably one of the best I've seen today. Uh, Diana? Yes.
Are the utilities, I'm sorry, are the uh, appliances included? Everything goes, um, it stays except for the refrigerator. Okay. We should have someone made her an offer, maybe. So rehab, you know, just on a surface gas to repaint, replace the sink and a few other items, probably going to end up needing to replace the top of this one. And uh, I don't know if we can get a part for it or we just have to pop it out and put a new one. It doesn't matter. The, uh, probably the dishwasher needs to get swapped out too. But everything's really clean. It looks pretty good.